for someone who's just starting a company, what should they be looking for in their co-founder? What are the traits or things uh, that are a sign the relationship's going to work out? Um, first off, you are looking for a vesting schedule that's one in four. <laughs> no matter what. Um, next, um, think about a Venn diagram. And think about not only your skills here in one circle, but your personality traits. Think about your co-founder and their personality traits and their skills. This is almost asymptotic. These should only be touching at a few points. Those circles overlap on mission, right? What are you doing? Vision doesn't necessarily have to happen yet. Like mission, um, values, and grind, commitment, right? That third one becomes a thing. Some people just do not. This is not a world for almost anyone. It is, it is so hard. And there are so many hours that if you cannot absolutely work your ass off and you're not built like that, you're not going to make it. Yeah, having a, being a founder is definitely not a 40-hour work week. I remember the first time I did a company, there were like months of like 80 to 100 hour weeks. It's not even a 40 hour sleep week. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that, I'll also have that experience. It's a little easier the second time around. It was easier. It is a little bit, but like if you're, in my opinion, if you're sleeping a lot, or if you're not working very hard, then you're not, you may not be doing something hard enough, right? This whole idea of like work smarter, not harder in startups, you have to do both if you're doing something big, right? It is, uh, it's hard and not a lot of people are cut out for that. Not a lot of people are, you got to be a little fucking crazy. <laughs> 